So we've been studying about the prophetic and it's an exciting journey as we uh, learn about the prophetic and uh, what is important is uh, what is important is that we step into it that we don't um, just have a head knowledge of the prophetic but we actually step in and do it that we actually spend time uh, hearing God's voice receiving his word and um, and that's just one part of it but the the second important part is that we we interpret and then we we deliver the word uh and we we are bold enough to do it now there could be um uh there could be many reasons why we hold back uh from operating in the prophetic why we hold back from uh really ministering in the prophetic maybe we had a bad experience maybe we had a uh we had we did we did not have a proper understanding of the gift now that could be one reason maybe we did not have uh, a proper teaching about the gift so when we when we you and i when we read the word when we see that it is for all believers when we see that when we exercise um the gifts of the spirit in the right way as laid down in scripture that should free us up that should actually liberate us to um to really joyfully move in these gifts uh to because uh because god desires that we have been designed to to really operate in these gifts to exercise the gifts so so best thing to do is to to get a proper teaching to get grounded and get all the information and also let that information become a revelation and that we will it will become an experience that we will move to action and uh, uh another reason why we may not we might hold back uh, from uh, exercising the gifts is probably we we have a sense of unworthiness we're saying uh you know i see all these faults in me uh, i see all these um, all these things that i'm not doing right and there could be a sense of unworthiness saying how can god use me maybe god will use someone who is uh, you know more gifted more talented more committed and so on but um we need to keep away that sense of unworthiness because it's it's god who has actually called us and it's god who has qualified us he has washed us with his precious blood and he has justified us and he is the one who is faithful faithful and his grip on us is strong um, you know second corinthians 3 and verse 5 paul in, in all his humility this is what he says he states he says that not that we are sufficient of ourselves to think of anything as being from ourselves but our sufficiency is from god so we come to that place of saying it's not my special talent it's not my ability but i'm just trusting in him who who has all the ability who is all powerful who, who is all knowing so the more we focus on ourselves you know we we look at our faults and we say i'm unworthy but then we need to focus on god and what he has done on the cross for us and uh, then we can actually you know move forward so uh, another reason could be fear you know we fear making a mistake we fear uh you know doing something wrong what if i say something and it's not right what if i i step into the prophetic all of us make mistakes you know when we when we the 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 time when we uh started learn to ride our bicycles and and we fell down we did not say uh you know i'm never going to ride again but we got up and we rode and that's why in scripture you know especially about the prophetic um god has put down that that instruction that you submit the prophecy and if you if you read that uh, chapter 4 chapter 14 it says so that all can learn which means that i i do something right i learn from it i do something wrong and i still learn from it so um so there's no fear of making mistakes of course we will make mistakes so that we learn from it and we keep moving on so let's pray and ask god to uh, to do these things in us father we thank you that you've called us father we thank you that um, that you're helping us lord you are you are a helper you're helping us overcome all these hindrances lord overcome our fears overcome the fear of making mistakes overcome the fear of failure and fear of man overcome even the sense of unworthiness and uh, and may we learn from our mistakes may we learn from uh, our successes and uh, may we give you all the glory as we journey on with you we give you all praise we give you all glory in jesus name we pray amen thank you for tuning in to living supernaturally 
For more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.